over 200 Mara East Bank Burbese residents are now receiving potable water. This follows the recommissioning of the community's water supply system. Here are the details. The upgrade and reopening of the new $5 million water supply system was a direct result of the old system being vandalized. Minister of Public Affairs Don Hastings Williams, addressing Mara residents, urged them to be vigilant and ensure there is no reoccurrence of vandalism. My encouragement to you today, however, is to ask each one of you, boys and girls, men and women, young men and young women, to be the guardian of your water system. Denounce to the relevant authorities whenever there is anybody who's trying to interfere to thieve these things, ensure that you report the matter to the relevant authorities very quickly. Managing Director of GWI, Dr. Richard Van West Charles, told residents that initially, the new water supply system will provide them with six hours of water per day. However, in another two weeks, they can expect that time to be increased. Another two weeks. We're going to get some batteries to store the power. And Mr. Sheko has just indicated to me one battery was already donated from the community. And we're going to get some batteries to allow you to have water 24 hours a day. The rehabilitation of the system was a collaborative effort between the government and residents of Mara. Aubrey Chisholm, who was instrumental in the effort, had this to say. I have children with the school. And I see the needs of water. And I say that I am mine to do what it takes to let this water, the reconditioned water, come again in Mara. Dr. Van West Charles noted that access to potable water is an important element in ensuring citizens of Ghana are afforded a good quality of life.